What up? You wanna know how to achieve this matte autumn berry sunset look? Then you stay and you watch. I've done the base of my face and the brows, so let's get into the eyes. Come here closer, come come. I've primed my eyelids beforehand using Max Hawker Pen Pot. Using a big eye brush, I'm loading up the mixture of Makeup Geek Cream Brulee and Peach Smoothie on my crease. I'm buffing it out real good on the crease because I want that very buffed up warm transition color. You don't have to worry if it gets too high on the brow bone or too low on the lid. Use a vanilla or bone colored shade and put it on the first third of the eyelid area. As you can see, I'm not really being precise on where it stops because life's too short for that man. Too short. Using an angle eye brush, I'm taking Chikadi from it. Kapki and laying the color starting from the outer corner of the eyelid and bring it forward to merge with the vanilla eyeshadow. Don't take it too far to the front, just two thirds of the eyelid. Make sure to blend it well with the vanilla shade to ensure a seamless gradient look. Taking a warm orangey shadow with a blending brush, start defining the outer view of the lid. Here I'm just making the shadow on the corner of the lid at first and then slowly blending it in into the crease I'm using a pinkish berry color and laying it on the outer lid. Using the same technique that I used earlier, I packed the shadow with a precision brush first and I went in with the same blending brush that I used just now to blend it into the crease. Here I'm just adjusting the eyelid color and blend the edges with the first brush that I use with no additional product. For a liner, I want to create a cranberry colored but I don't have one so I'm mixing two liner colors here first I use a dark brown and create a half wing liner then I traced the same liner shape with a reddish colored liner so many liners using a pencil brush I take chickadee and run it on the lower lash line after that I'm using a definer brush to define the Lower later eyeshadow color closer to the lower lash line before buffing it in with the same pencil brush. I decided to intensify the barriness of the outer lid, so I did that. You can too, just adjust or intensify the color as you go. I'm using the same vanilla eyeshadow to highlight my brow bone and inner corner. Prep your lashes with mascara before putting on falsies. And while waiting for the lashes glue to dry, let's move on and complete the face makeup. I'm bronzing my face with my favorite Morphe E52 brush. Never thought I'd like it as much, but ooh, I do. I do. So I'm using the same bronzer to contour my nose and give it some definition. For my blush, I'm using a sheer one and blend it all over my cheeks for that flushed look. My 
my current favorite way of highlighting laying down cream highlight first before setting it with powder highlight go blind people go blind I use the same alien toe brush that I used to highlight the brow bone and inner corner to highlight my nose and cupid's bow I'm finishing up the look with my favorite Give Me Glow liquid lipstick. It's the new shade that I got uh, called Devi. I feel like Give Me Glow liquid lipstick makes the most appearance on my video. <laughs> And that's it for this look. Hope you guys enjoy it. See you in my next video. Peace.